Here's a fun fact. The LEGO group will never make anything to do with conflict. They will also not make something that they deem too inappropriate. South Park. If LEGO won't make South Park, I guess I will. By the end of this, I will have made my very own short South Park animation in LEGO. But first, we need characters. The core cast of characters are made up of very simple colours and shapes, so shouldn't be too hard. This was, in fact, not true. There are so many pieces that are seemingly perfect for the characters, but not every piece comes in every colour, so I took some creative liberty. This is Cartman. He has a red torso, which I have vandalised. He also has a robber's hat, on which I have painted the appropriate colours. It is pretty much the same case for Kyle, however, just his hat had to be modified. They are not perfect, but they are something. And because I know I will need them, here is Cartman's mum and Mr. Kitty. Cartman's mum uses the face of Padme and the hair of Leia from Star Wars, creating a strange kind of fusion between mother and daughter. This is not my first time animating South Park, so by now I know what to expect. First, I need to train an AI to talk like the South Park characters. It never sounds perfect, but it is still pretty impressive. I tried asking the Snapchat AI to tell me some jokes about Lego South Park. Yeah, based on this, I think the human race is safe for now. Training the AI involves pirating the footage of the show, painstakingly cutting out all the lines from the character you want to dodgily replicate, and then feeding it into the website. Pretty boring. I needed to test out my new Kyle voice, so I animated a quick test. Please, 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 subscribe to the MPT channel. Do what he says or else his dad will sue you. His dad is a lawyer, if you didn't know. This is Cartman's house, and I need to make it in Lego. After the walls were built, I made the couch, table, and light. I was tempted to recreate this painting from their wall, but I'd rather make them live in a bland world with nothing interesting to entertain their feeble minds. And wow, I animated the shots from this part of the scene. I was trying to keep the snappy, slightly sporadic movement of South Park while making each motion flow nicely into the next. Honestly, getting Cartman to walk was hard because the short Lego legs don't actually move. I set up for this back and forth wobbling, which to be fair is surprisingly accurate to what they do in the show. And now that I have animated the scene, more. I made Mr. Kitty fly by attaching him to this rig, which I can remove in post. That sentence probably sounded weird because you don't know the story yet. Just accept that the cat needed to fly and we can move on. I wanted a kind of intro to the short when the boys realise they have turned into Lego. So I started with this green card as the floor and then swapped it for a base plate and put the figures on it. Then I could animate actual South Park characters talking and have them transition into their Lego counterparts. I feel like there should be a website that has all the South Park assets so that you can just animate whatever you like with them, because right now, if I want to make them move, I need to download them and then CUT OFF THEIR HEADS so that they can move independently. That is nearly all, but I need to give them the South Park mouths that follow what they are saying. This is always the part I hate the most about making these. But, after all that... Yeah, well, you are the worst person I know. Ha! At least I'm not a Jew. Wait. Why are you Lego? You're Lego as well. I am so confused, dude. Mom, what the hell? Why do I look so weird? Oh, honey, you're just big boned. No, I mean, I look like a toy. This is so lame. Well, everything looks normal to me, darling. <coughs> no, kitty, I'm the bad kitty! <coughs> oh, how sweet. 